What is going on today, guys? It is Step On a Gaming back after a really long delay. I was gone for about a month, and now that I'm back, we're gonna be on the normal recording schedule, and we have a new game today, guys. So I heard a decent amount about this game. This game is called Dirty Bomb. It's a free-to-play game. It's one of those games that's kind of uh, a bit of a pay-to-win, but not too much. It's not not too noticeable. Um, it has a class setup uh, similar to Team Fortress 2. If you guys have ever played that game. Um, it's very fast paced, but the objectives are pretty cool. I like the objective kind of based game modes. Uh, it's kind of attack and defend in a way. Uh, so one team will have to do an objective and you have to stop the other team from completing that objective. Oh, man. And there's a bunch of other classes, but the thing is you don't have all the classes to start off with. You have to purchase them with uh, credits that you earn uh, throughout playing matches and stuff. Some characters are more expensive than others, but you can pay them outright paying cash. Um, which is how it can be pay to win. So if you pay like fifty dollars, you can get all the guns, all the classes, all that stuff. But it's not, it's not nothing too crazy. Um, but they do have something cool where they'll have free rotation, where they'll do the characters will be free for this weekend. You can play those characters, that kind of thing. So that's how I'm playing this character. His name is Artie. Um, I don't have him unlocked, but since he's in free rotation, I'm able to play as him. Um, and there is some cool stuff is that you can open chests, which are kind of cool. Um, the chests will basically give you different loadouts for your characters, different loadouts have different weapons, different skills, and obviously there's rarities, kind of like CSGO crates in a way, because you know you have a good chance you have a good chance of getting a less rare card than you do of getting a super rare card. That kind of thing. Alright, so let's let's just do some just total destruction. Uh, I'm not playing medic, I'm actually running support, so I really can't heal people, but sometimes I play Sawbones when he's in free rotation, because he is really good actually. Medic classes are good. Uh, I feel like it's better to play someone that can heal in sometimes because uh, you can find ammo around, but you can find health around. If that makes any sense, like around the map, sometimes you'll find like an ammo crate and you could fill up on ammo, but you won't you won't find a health crate. Well, at least I haven't so far. Maybe there is. I just didn't know about them, but that's really the gist of it. Ah, oh, damn it. Uh, let me try this this girl. I've never played her before. Okay, this comes with a sight. All right, let's see how this works out. Never played as this character before. Let's do it. Ammo station. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Are we getting flanked? Hopefully not. Jeez. We're getting destroyed. That's all I know. Oh. There we go. I like the three round burst. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Oh, someone's doing. E ammo station? I've never I've never used an ammo station before. Hey, come here, come here. Oh, oh. I like Bush Bushwaka, whatever the hell that guy's name is. He can deploy turrets, and I think that is a really cool uh, thing. So if you if you guys like that, it's kind of like the engineer class in TF2 in a way, but you can't upgrade your sentries. You can only place them, which kind of sucks, but I guess it's a little bit better. All right, I'm gonna go back around because I don't want to die. So they do have the double jump; it comes in handy. It's pretty cool. It's a cool little feature they added. Um, let's, let's, come on! Oh, we can't get up there. There we go. Where are they? Oh man, there was a lot of them. All right then, let's play some Sky Hammer. Sky Hammer is pretty cool. He's like the uh, the overall class kind of guy. You know, he's got the assault rifle, fully automatic. But his skills aren't too amazing. But if you get the rare loadout of him, he's probably really good. I just have a iron loadout. I think that is iron. I don't know what the. Oh, I just hit the wrong button. Uh, I, I believe that's what it is. Um, I don't know why I hit tab thinking that would show me, but when I die, I'll figure it out. So since I have a different loadout, it gives me this gun with the skin. It changes the the knife, everything, which is cool. Here we go. Gotcha. So the, the kind of annoying thing is when you shoot somebody and you kill them, uh, they fall on the floor and then you have to shoot them again to finish them off. So that's one kind of annoying thing, but it's kind of cool because then you heal them. But I wish they wouldn't be able to like, you know, still be there. Like you'd have to shoot them to kill them. I, I, I don't know if I'm explaining this correctly, but uh, I'm not a big fan of that. But I get over it, you know? Alright, let's use an airstrike marker. Oh, jeez. Go! Oh, is that an? Oh, that's teammate. Teammate. For a sec, I almost like. I was like, what the heck? Ammo pack. 
So I got like unlimited ammo basically with this guy. Oh! Ooh. How you feel? Finished them off. Damn right. I need some health now. Health regens, but it takes a long time. And I don't like waiting for my health to regen, you know? Alright. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I was gonna say, how did he kill me so fast? And the guy with the katana just sliced me in half. Alright, let's, let's, let's get this over with. Disable the EV. I'll disable the EV, no problem. The thing is, the matches can be pretty long at times, but we only got a minute left. I joined kind of in the middle of the match. I didn't really join as soon as it started. But, not too bad. Oh, there we go. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa! Hey! 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 Damn right, son! Need ammo. Oh, God. Jeez. Alright, this, this isn't looking too good. Ah, oh. right, I switched to Artie. Artie's kind of my my long range man. He's a beast. Well, he's the one I got the best card with because he has three abilities with the card, and I like the camo on it. It's kind of cool. Okay, and the semi auto is okay. I'm I'm not a huge fan of the semi auto. Okay, I think there's only a couple full auto weapons, and SMGs are really underpowered, which I kind of like because SMGs, you know, in every Every first-person shooter, they're so overpowered for no n reason whatsoever. And they put the damage really low on them, so that way, you know, if you're running around with an SMG, you're going to have to put a whole clip into someone just to actually kill them, you know, which is which makes it really nice. Um, they're not, like, two-shot kill, and then you got, like, a 60 rounds. It's not that kind of thing, which I like. All right, come on, let's go. The respawn times are a bit of annoying, but with the objective, it kind of makes sense. That way you're not flooding the objective and not being able to complete it, so it kind of makes sense. Okay, um, oh, invisible guy. Lost him. Oh, oh, oh. Jeez. Got him. Ah, match ended. Uh, 24, 25, 40. That's not too bad. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. And you know the drill. If you guys like the video, leave a like so I know to post more of these videos. If you guys want to get updates when my next videos come out, do not forget to subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs>